popular pizza place and entertainment center for children is shutting down here in Maine in just five days. Good evening, and thanks for joining us. I'm Tracy Sable. The parent company of Chuck E. Cheese's made that announcement today, saying their last day of operation will be this Sunday. News it's Allie Miles is live in South Portland with reaction on what's behind the closure. Allie. Yeah, Tracy, Chuck E. Cheese parent company CEC Entertainment made the announcement today that they're closing this location at the main mall now that the lease is up because they can't come to terms on legal terms. So what does that mean for pay, uh, the customers and what does that mean for employees? Hey, are you going to be over it by then? Or do you want to want Chuck E. Cheese to close, right? You want to stay open, right? As hard as it is for parents to hear the mouses closing up shop. Um, there's really nowhere to go besides here. Like, you live in Biddeford and uh, the only place to go is Chuck E. Cheese. The kids aren't too happy to hear the news either. Because all the games and I get tickets and I'll, um, I just wish it wouldn't go down and I like toys. Adrian Anderson is turning four years old. How old are you, DJ? How old am I? There you go. His dad says it's a shame others won't be able to have their birthday parties where, as the slogan goes, a kid can be a kid. It kind of thinks uh, this is a cheap mm -hmm. place. CEC Entertainment says it's refunding or rescheduling all customers' parties and events. Happy birthday. Do you mean try? Try. It also told the 20 employees at the South Portland location that they have jobs at any other Chuck E. Cheese establishment if they want them. In a statement, CEC Entertainment says we are thankful for the dedicated service of our score cast members in South Portland and we appreciate their support during this transition. We hope to find a new home in South Portland soon. Some of the customers say, I want to send it to you. What about you? I got the new monster. A new location is the best solution. I got my new cup of tea. I don't know, buddy. Hopefully they do. So what's going to go in here next? The general manager of the main mall says nobody has signed anything yet, but a home furnishings retailer is a possibility. If those negotiations go through, they could be in here as early as May 1st. Reporting live in South Portland, Allie Miles, Music.